right, I'm going to teach you a quick little tutorial on how to use EV and have transparent images because the older method of just switching to Alpha Blend does not work currently, at least for the later builds that are currently coming out with a Blender 2.8. So, for example, I will take this. I'll take this little plane here and right now I'm working on some grass. But let's say I wanted to upload a different image or get my grass on there in the first place. So what we do is we're going to go to Shader. And now that we created a new material, we're going to go down and we're going to go find our image. So since I already uploaded it, I'm just going to put Image Texture. Go here and find my grass texture. Now, notice that it has a black background right here. This is my alpha and this is the transparency for PNGs or I think they're called Targa files. I might be pronouncing that wrong. But as you can see, some people will say, if you just switch to alpha blend, it'll go transparent for a transparent image. That is, that is super false. What you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to go into your node editor and let's pull this guy over here for a second. Pull this guy up here. What we're gonna add is we're gonna add a new shader. We're gonna add a transparent shader. Stick that up there. And now we're gonna go Shift A and we're gonna add a mix shader. Now, before we start plugging some stuff in, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our principal, our principal shader over here, and we're gonna plug this into the bottom. Now, once we have that plugged in, take our transparent, we plug this into the top shader. Now, notice something's happening right now, right? It's gonna, it's gonna look like this. This isn't what you want. It's, it's obvious. It's still, it's definitely not what you wanted. It's not what I wanted. So, what we're gonna do to fix this is very simple. We pull this down and just grab the elf over here and put that into our factor. And boom. You now have a transparent image without having to do a bunch of research like I did for the past hour or so without getting any kind of leads until I finally went to the Blender forms and was helped by an awesome person. So yeah, I hope this helps you out a little bit. I'm, I'm not a, I'm not a tutorial maker, but I thought this needed to be answered because I couldn't find it anywhere whatsoever on the internet. So I will check you all later. Peace out and have a good rest of your day.